first since 2020, 12 overall. How does this one feel? Uh, I don't feel real, honestly. Uh, I don't know. I, I can't explain it in words, just to be honest. So. You look at this team, where you guys started wasn't the greatest of starts for this program or for this team this year, but you guys get better week after week. You finish on the stage in dominating fashion. What does that say about this team? Uh, we're just hardworking, we're determined, and uh, we play for one. We play as one. So at the end of the day, that's what got the job done. So You were dominating on the ground, you, Geo. What was working for you so well in the ground game? Uh, I think our line just really came out today and just pushing the blockers back and gave me the holes to run through. So I'm really grateful for that. Defensively, you guys were flying around all day, only holding North Posey to three points. What was the biggest key to just shutting the, uh, shutting things down on that end? Just locking down on each one of our individual keys and uh, just playing the game of football as we know it. So it was good. I think this is the first one for Coach Lindsay as head coach here. Uh, to, to do that for him, just what does that mean? Uh, I'm honored to do it for him, be the first one to do it, and uh, I'm proud. So. Yeah. Was there a point in the season where you started feeling like this was a real possibility for your team? Definitely, yeah. Uh, I say week three is when we finally started coming together after those two losses, and we just started put it, building our team up, and I saw potential. This was a big deal, the SAC switching up its schedule and letting you guys play different opponents. The first two losses were pretty bad, and Snyder had a loss in their first two games, but how much do you think that paid off for teams like you guys? I, it gave us a different look at different competition, something we're not used to, so... I'd say it definitely paid off in the end, in the long run. You guys had a lot of short fields today because of defense and special teams. Just how much does that help the offense when you have 30 yards to go? That makes the whole difference. We saw their field position. We took advantage of it, and uh, that's what it came down to. How fun was it to have that combo with Gia in the backfield this whole year? Uh, it's unreal. I was having so much fun. It was like Christmas. I don't know. <laughs> Being able to score a touchdown under the bright lights of Lucas Oil, what's that feeling like for you? Uh, I feel like I was in a dream. Uh, you know, scoring uh, at Lucas Oil doesn't feel real. Yeah, and especially early on in the game, you were running hard all game. Uh, just what's going, what's going through your mind whenever you're breaking those tackles and uh, firing them? Uh, when I'm running the ball, I'm just thinking yard by yard. I got to pick up yards, and uh, whoever gets in my way, they got to go. So I got to put them over.